preserve the culture and not just to be writing stuff down or collecting material but to try to get some young people involved in it they would have some sort of a hunger or desire to learn kind of how our great grandmother sort of reinforced it with us and other folks and those older folks what the technique was she did it but it was real subtle on a daily basis and it wasn't verbal for whatever reasons it made us understand about where we were from we're from here for as far back as you care to go and that the people that live in Auburn, the native people, the non-native people, the fact that we live right here where it happened, the epicenter of this whole situation, and that story isn't known. Framed by the greed and the attitude of the times Polk firmly stated that Mexico will soon fall in line His vision of our borders lies somewhere here in the west Manifest destiny is now at the top of his list. Shoot first, lie later, the official motto of this land. Whether it's Columbus, Polk, or bounty hunters, their means justify the end. Though the numbers don't add up as any fool can see. They'll never get back the land we stole through manifest destiny. You know, in our philosophy, we stay here. Our spirits die, but we stay here. So we maintain our identity here. So even in death, we're still here. And it's like a different heaven. It's not the Christian heaven or the Muslim heaven or the Hindu heaven or whatever. It's my do heaven. And maybe that's part of that. Maybe not being so afraid, not, not being afraid of, of dying like we are today. The through line of the musical is pretty much a love story between Maikule and Ine. Now Ine, he was a son of a sub-chief of the Nishinan tribe. A quarter of the way through the musical, Maikule gets taken by Sutter slavers. What I was taught in school about Sutter was that he built a great fort that welcomed all the new settlers to California, and he helped people. But that's only half the story. The other half is what happened to the people who he used, who he destroyed. So Baikule gets taken by Sutter, and she becomes a house servant. Now Sutter's house servants, they not only served food and cleaned up the house, he used them in other ways. Our musical is trying to tell the story of resilience. Resilience of the nation on people. I want to see more people, and not just as in our point of view as the native people, but I want to see all people experience what is coming from this. And what is coming all together from our voices, our actions, and our doings, all together to teach. Justice is mine. Spike this. Put it outside the gates for all to see. And chain her in my cars. Why, oh why, do we do 
all the terrible things that we do? Why, oh why, do we say that forget the vows that we made? Why are men so bad, wretched men in their wretched little world? Why don't you crawl into your wretched little